anyway, let's just get out of here. I don't know why that whirlwind didn't appear for me and the Gorons. Because that Goron side quest is probably very important, but... Yeah, oh well. Can't be helped. Anyway, there's another farm down here. Look at you. I want to go. I want to be near this place. But that rock is blocking me and there's no whirlwind there to give me an extra lift. I know I'm just complaining, but yeah. But anyway, this is e e e e Be careful where you're doing that. It makes me feel so close to nature. Ah. Sometimes it's just really annoying, but anyway. We see you want to watch the Kingstone pieces? Yes, I do. Let's fuse Kingstones. Hopefully something good will happen. But anyway, I got a lot of Kingstones while I'm trying to get some money. You should look at it, see? Got tons of them. Anyway, yeah, it, if you want to go on side quest, it's right there. If you want to feel so much stronger now. Here we go! Breaking those rocks! Bam! Um, I'm not sure I'll do the Goron side quest mainly because, um, there's no whirlwind, um, or hurricane or tornado. So, I can't do that just yet, but hopefully I can. Eventually. Rock, rock and roll. Yes, I love your atti attitude. Let's fuse Kingstones. Yeah, well, rock and roll. Um, yeah, why not? I still have one left after this. King, the two kingstone pieces fit perfectly. Something good will happen. I hope it will because. Oh, that's just Mount Cornell. God, I have to come back to there. I have to go back to Mount Cornell, really? I hated Mount Cornell. Alright, fits like a chip off the old rock. Oh well, whatever. Alright, now we basically want to go down because remember we fused kingstones, there's that treasure chest that's been mocking us. You got an empty bottle, sweet. Alright, um... Wow. Oh uh, yeah, those, these things are freaking invincible. I can't do anything to you guys. But anyway, I want to stay well away from there since I've already been there. But anyway, let's just go back to my grandfather's house. And look, there's Tingle. I, I knew I came back here for some reason. Anyway, let's just fuse Kingstone through this guy. Green cape and green clothes. Are you perhaps a fairy? Well, I knew it, I knew it. Tingle wants to be a fairy too. Actually, yeah, I have some Kingstone pieces. Hey, Mr. Fairy, shall we try to fuse Kingstone? Do you do? Why not? Tingo. Ting Tingle seems like a cool guy. Do I have a piece for Tingle? Yes, I have tons of these green pieces. Sweet, they fit together. And boom. Oh yeah, there's a rock area there, but we can't do anything there, which is why I didn't um, explain those sort of areas yet. Alright, sweet. Um, we got three empty jars and a new something. I don't know what it was. But anyway, there's one more thing we have to do in Hyrule Town. And that is to talk to the sword master again because we can learn a new technique oh yeah oh yeah I forgot we have to get our Pegasus boots he said to run like the wind and uh, the Pegasus boots will let us run like the wind so why not put the two to two, two together and you should have that sort of thing you give him the mushroom and BAM Wow, what's this terrifying bad smell a wake up mushroom should I have guessed? So you woke me up? Thanks. I just remembered I have something urgent to do. Huh? What? Now? There are some more new shoes. You probably won't believe this, but... I have a strange habit of making shoes in my sleep. Oh, sure. It's not like there's little minish people helping you out. No, no, no. That's just... That's just stupid. So it must be you going to your sleep. You must be a freaking genius. But anyway... Um, he's just making us the Pegasus boots. And there you go. Take it. Take these. Those are my special Pegasus boots. They're so light they'll feel like that you're practically walking on air, which is what we need. Oh, I need. I need to hurry and get back to work on a special order. The king asked me to make some shoes for the princess Zelda. You see. Oh, too bad she turned to stone. Oh well. All right. Um. Let's just 
try out the Pegasus boots because I'm very interested and see we got three out of the four bottles. Ain't that awesome? Um, but now we have to switch this back to B. Oh, right, there we go. Much better. So, I uh, as you can see, it's really just awesome. It makes you run so fast, and yeah. Besides making yourself run so fast, there's also a technique you can learn from the Grand Swordmaster. Ah, yes, you have the Pegasus boots. You seem to have been more skilled too. Um, yes, I'm ready to train you again. Sweet! Would you like to train here? Yes, I really love to. You'll now learn the new technique, the Dash Attack. First, equip the Pegasus boots. Second, equip your sword. Third, run like crazy. That's all. Swordsman, do you understand? Yes, I do. So basically all you need is your Pegasus boots and your sword. Oh, and where is fine student? I guess you don't get much students, don't you? Alright. That's why I will now possess your body. Same old, same old. Let's get this over and done with, sir. I'll be on my way after this. The switcheroo technique. Bam! Right in the face. Phew. You must try it yourself. Equip the Pegasus boots your sword and run like crazy all right oh yeah we have to do that and there nothing not that hard yes fine work you learn quickly now give this ti tiger scroll you will forget you will never forget this technique you learn from straight from the scroll I always remember these techniques mainly because I don't need it or they just happen to do it by itself like breaking rocks but anyway but we got the Pixis boots which makes us run so fast that we can't even control ourselves um, so basically what we have to do is hold B, um, until you hit a wall or something. Some people can actually run like the wind, literally. They can walk, they can run this whole area just by doing that. But apparently I can't because I just suck at these controls. Um, so yeah. So let's just go back to, um, what was it called? Ah, I forgot what it was called. Oh yeah, Long Long Ranch. How can I forget? Link's love interest is around here. But anyway. Um. Oh yeah, there's, there's something we can do around here. Check it. Bam. Yes, uh, if you ever see any trees that um have the particular shade of color, just run right across it. You, believe me. Oh yeah, there's, there's introduction of worms and new enemies. There's a chest with kingstone piece. That was, a, that was pretty much a waste of a... Um, Kingstone piece for Kingstone piece, but whatever. Trade for trade, but basically what we're here for is the piece of heart. Um, collect two more to increase my heart container. Sweet. Oh man, the worm. They can actually eat you and they'll poop you out. I I would like to say crap, and which I just did, but I'm not sure if I have any young viewers. A lot of people are like my age, just in their um preteens, attending high school this year, something like that. But anyway, let's just go back to this area, since we now t uh, have spoken with Tingle. Um, we can now t uh, talk to his brother, which is up here. Yes, huge spoilers. This game was released ages ago, you guys should all know this. Hello there, Mr. Fairy. My brother Tingle wanted me to thank you for you helping him out. All we did was just fuse kingstones. Not really... Um, anything important. What do you say, want to try it? Sure, why not? Fuse kingstones, I hope you got the right one that fits. Indeed we have, because we got tons of kingstones off screen. Perfect fit, as as I as to be expected. And we unlocked two out of the f uh, four trees. You need all four of them so you can get the treasure chest in the middle. Um, yeah. So that's another side quest, major side quest, which is finding the four Tingle Brothers. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting. We have to go out the other way. All right. Um, let's see what else can I do around here. I guess there really is nothing for me to do around here that um requires anything. Uh, I guess I can just cut until I actually find any more of those trees because I know there's more trees. I I, I actually ran into them while I was doing a couple of side quests. Um, when I was trying to get some rupees, so yeah, there's there's definitely some things we can do around here. There's no there's no point denying that. Oh yeah, that's that's where you get the great fairy. I'm pretty sure of that. I'm definitely sure of that. Anyways, just keep going down. 
these guys are freaking invincible to swords and bombs, to be more specific. Oh yeah, this guy said about something about choosing kingstones. So why don't we go back there and check if he still wants to take me up on that offer. If not, I'll probably just cut the video until I actually find something worth showing. I just planted a big old bean. Hands in sprout, yeah, but when it does, I'm gonna be a big sucker. Can't fuse kingstones with him just yet. So, I guess I'm gonna put that on hold for now. But we'll come back, eventually. Um... Yeah, there's really is nothing for me to do, so... I'll cut until I actually find some of those trees, because I know there's trees around here. So, see you guys in just a sec. Alright, I couldn't find any of the shaded trees just yet. Wait, what's this? Oh yeah, it's the same area. Wow, he just he just he just knocked me out of my money, didn't he? I did not know that. oh yeah, I forgot he is a thief. But anyway, let's just continue on. Oh uh, why do I want to go back there for? I'll I'll just continue finding the shaded trees because I know I saw some unless I'm del delusional. Um, but anyway, um, we fused, um, Kingstones with both Tingle and his, one of his three brothers, unless there's something else I don't remember. But anyway, let's just go down. These are the trees. It's just right in front of Hyrule, so, lucky, luckily for that, because we know that Vati possessed the king. Unfortunately, Link doesn't know that, because he was somewhere south of Hyrule. But anyway, I'll continue looking for that off screen, but if I can't find anything, oh well. But I know next episode, we're going to be heading to the next temple, unless there's something majorly important. Which I don't think so. Um... Yeah, so two kingstone pieces. I'm not sure if it was worth it, but I'm pretty sure that giant chest has a meaning. So yeah, we'll, we'll find out what the chest leads to as soon as we get the other two Tingle Brothers. Which won't be for um, a decently long time. Um, we're, we're up to the 30 minute mark, but... It's pro but I'm probably going to be doing a lot of cutting, and I just realized I forgot to do this. Hold up the sacred powers, we grant you the power to win. Oh, that stone obelisk crumbled, and there's another one of those marks. You know, no matter how many times I see that happen, it still rattles me. Oh, good for you. So, um, is there anything else? Oh yeah, the mayor's house. Uh, you know the mayor's house has all those masks? We got a technique that can actually knock them down. Um, uh, you actually get a decent amount of money if you just knock them all down, because their mask apparently, they're valuable. Uh, up there, there's really no one there that you can talk to, so... It, it probably isn't worth your trouble right now. At least I think so. Yeah, I don't think there's anything worth, um, the trouble of talking to them yet. But anyway, we actually did, um, a decent amount of recording. So, next time... Um, whatever this guy said. Next time on The Legend of Zelda The Minish Cap, I'll be playing some more Skyward Sword and we'll be entering the third dungeon of the game. So, this is the guy that size. Peace out, everyone.